how to fix scan issues in SP test kit 2600 all in one printer series open your browser and search for this website which is support.hp.com and just press the enter key now you will see this website where you just need to scroll down and in this box you just need to type the printer model name for which you are going to fix scan issues as you can see i have typed the printer model name and uh, this is exact printer which is matching so i will click on it after clicking this page will open where you can see printer model name and its image now just scroll down and here in troubleshooting section you will find all issues related to printer so we are going to fix a scan issues so here you need to click on download because it will fix by downloading driver so click on download now software is downloading here with the name of hpp sdr.exe once downloaded you can follow the instructions now i'm going to launch it by clicking here on this icon click on open after that it will ask your permission to make changes to your device so click on yes so as you can see now hp print and scan doctor is launched so this is the driver which is going to fix scan issues so in only two steps it will fix issues in your printer in first step you need to select your product and in second step it will find and fix problems so all you just need to do it you need to just click on start but before that make sure your printer and your pc should be connected in same network so that it could detect your printer and fix issue so i'm going to click on start now it is searching for the printers available in the same network and now i'm getting this message because there is no new printer available in my network if any printer will be detected in your network then it will display you here just you need to select that and click on next to proceed further and follow on screen instructions to fix the issue in your printer so i hope this video was helpful to you if you want any further help you can call us on the given number in this video description or click on the support link